Hello, and here are the latest global LGBTI news headlines from Pink 60. Homeless people in Washington, D.C. have been under extra stress this week, with the presidential inauguration forcing them off the streets. Shelters are full and church doors are closed, but Casa Ruby stepped up with extra beds, hot food and Covid masks. A study into the risks of self-harming bisexual people has delivered disturbing results. It found minority stress and bullying have a direct impact, with bisexual people far more likely to self-harm than their straight, gay or lesbian peers. The Australian Bureau of Statistics will include a sex recorded at birth option in this year's census. The form will offer male, female or non-binary, with an optional details box if you want to add specifics. A biography of Dennis Nielsen, based on his personal notes, includes new crimes with which he was never charged. In History of a Drowning Boy, Nielsen admits to a sexual assault and two other murders, but the killer died behind bars in 2018. And finally, Nats Getty has revealed that they identify as transgender and non-binary. Getty made the announcement on Instagram, alongside a photo proudly showing the results of recent top surgery. But you can find out more on these and other stories on our social media pages, and join us again next time for more LGBTI news headlines.